See something in there? Master? Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. Focus. Try again. Trust yourself. Yes, Master. Faster and more intensive. Reach my position. I did it. Persistence and the Force is my ally. Just remembering old tricks. Think you can show me that shortcut again? Racy there? Oh, it's on. Let's see what's inside. We're not finished yet. Okay, okay, he probably would have won. Probably. BD? Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Ino Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zepho once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zepho homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. <laughs> You 
No, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey. You want to meet some, uh, friends of mine? You passed the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? Get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! No! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of patrolling me fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A holo what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look. Before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Death Mirror Zepho, it's your choice. All right, here we go. Let's plot a course. Why would I? Eh, wouldn't hurt to throw some art on the walls. Something new to look at. Since when do you care about art? I've always liked it. When I was younger, I used to pour through every piece I could find at the Jedi archives. Did you critique them too? I admired them. 
When I became a seeker, I got to see a few in person. So many different cultures in the galaxy, and each one had their own unique works of art. It was breathtaking. Time to land. Get up here. This might not be the best time to land. Eh, yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Oh. Couple bumps ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Because it's under control, it's just a little tricky. <laughs> Easy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Cal, over here. Good work. Oh, we did it. We did it. I hope you're not hurt. What are you looking at? Who are you talking to? Uh, just my ship. The Manus. Good name, right? Intimidating. Hang on. in there. Yeah, all there is to worry about. 
In accordance with the Emperor's will, we've occupied Zepho, redistributing its inhabitants. This planet has failed to yield significant data or relics for Project Augur. Its electromagnetic winds have rendered the bulk of our mining technology useless. Meanwhile, more stormtroopers lose their lives to dangerous fauna. We will not be able to fulfill our directive here. It is my recommendation that we disband the project and leave a token... <laughs> Hey now. What is it? Oh my god. Finally, here we go. Cal, the Empire's pinpointed your location. You need to move fast. On it. Found something. What do they know? No mention of Cordova. I don't think the Empire knows he's been here. Then we have the advantage. For now. Interesting. We're on the right track.
can't get through. There's a storm up ahead. Something about it crippled the Empire's equipment. I can feel something... Me there. Beyond the storm. Follow it. Let the force sharpen your instincts. All right. I'll do my best. Huh. Another one of these. I wonder if they connect. I guess there's a puzzle that we need to solve or something. Never seen a storm do that before. Yeah, it's incredible. Tomb. It's massive. And the Empire? No sign of them down here. What about Cordova? Still not sure what I'm supposed to find. He's a little... Eccentric? Tell me about it. But he wouldn't send us here for his amusement. Keep an open mind. I guess that ball should go there. And we're gonna use push force. To do that. Did you see that? How predictable, oh. right? Oof. Okay. More squeezing. can kill the boss really nice really really nice wow <laughs> looks like i found an exploit uncompleted game against it the force is there to shield us the obstacles in your path define the path what stands in the way becomes the way now 
Try again. Keep your eye on the ball. Good. Continue. Faster now. Complete the test. It stands in the way. Comes the way. My friend, take a look at the detail on this bark. The distinctive striations. It can only be a rosier tree from Kashyyyk. It's time to call on an old friend. If the Zepho had contact with Kashyyyk, there is a good chance Chieftain Tarfel will know about it. Nothing happened. Okay. What did you find? The Zeppo went to Kashyyyk. Cordova mentioned someone named Tarful. Ah, a Wookiee chieftain. They were old friends. Think he's still around? There's only one way to find out. We have to go to Kashyyyk. Open the way for the Empire. Hey, get out here! Look up there! I'm done with this one! Was in there. I'm gonna stop you. Just give me a minute. It's all over now. Get, get back here.
Get up here. There he goes. Affirmative. That's not possible. I wasn't expecting this. It's a giant Zepho statue. Kind of thought there'd be Zepho stuff inside. <laughs> Scomplink? Yeah, you're right. I think I could replace yours with this. Let's get you fixed up. Try it out. This way. Thanks, PD-1. Come back here. What's that, PD-1?
said there this could way. be many more Jedi hiding throughout the galaxy. Well, that's the best. What was that? Go get him! <laughs> Keep your distance and fire! <laughs> Jokes, BD? I don't know. Why? <laughs> Classic. I just took down a trooper wearing black and red armor. The same type from Braca. A purge trooper. Their only purpose is to hunt Jedi. Are the Inquisitors coming? It's possible, but we're far from Braca. They might think purge troopers are enough. Or they could be stalling you on purpose. Stay wary.
We've got a walker firing on us, and our weapons are down. Is that him? Tell him he better get his butt. Hold on. I'm on my way. Nice work out there, kid. Hey, you got some real moves on you. <laughs> Just tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. I found the tomb of a Zepho sage. They definitely used the Force. An advanced civilization of Force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zepho journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Sheik, I look, things are really bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those Wookiees big time. Don't you better get ready for a fight? Uh. I think this lifestyle suits you. Fighting that walker seems to have made you more confident. So, how are you holding up? You mean with the Force? Yes, with the Force. I know you said it could be overwhelming. Haven't gotten myself killed yet. Rather not talk about it. Yeah, well, I understand. More than you realize. Why'd you choose to stop using the Force? When the Purge started and our clone troops turned against us, my Padawan and I took several younglings and we went into hiding. But we didn't last long. Imperial Patrol was about to discover our location, so I tried to lure them away from my Padawan Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings, but they caught me. And they tortured me. They wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but mostly they wanted to know about Cordova and where he went. But you escaped. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. Did she survive? No. That's why we can't give up. 
We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. Cordova had supplies. Let's go to Kashyyyk then.